Down the Valley d'Avon in Albania, the company Power is working on three massive turbines that are part of the hydro power plant Banya. The turbines will transmit the water of this river into green energy. Together, it's a massive and challenging project with great value to Albania. Yes, right, it's one of the biggest projects in Albania for the moment. Uh, in fact, this project is a, is a two stepped uh, hydropower plant. The first one is Banya, where we stand now, and the second one is in Bergdise, around uh, 15 kilometers on the uphill. Together, the two power plants will generate and supply Albania with almost 17% more energy. Annually, that sums up to be 729 gigawatt hours. It's invested by Stadtkraft and the Alstom is the main contractor for electrical and electromechanical works. And then the power is the subcontractor of Alstom. So we are taking care for all electromechanical activity on the site. Surely, uh, MB Power is an important company for us for the installation works. So, MB Power is our uh, electromechanical uh, turnkey contractor, subcontractor here, where we more considered as a partner. The Albanian company has proven its expertise and skill over the last 13 years in the construction and engineering of substations, like this one in Serik. It is at substations like these where Ambipower started working together with companies like Siemens, Alstom and Stadkraft, earning the respect and confidence along the way. Taking part in the Devil Hydro Power project is unlike anything Ambipower did before. It's an exciting and new step forward for the company. This is a good, good project for us because we are making some diversification of our business just to, to be part of not only transmission and distribution, but even for generation. This new step comes with new challenges and responsibilities. Surely, uh, MB Power is, uh, is providing the required uh, infrastructure to come to this level and even today demonstrate the, the capacity to perform the activities at a certain uh, level. At the offices of MB Power, preparations are made by the quality manager to meet all the high standards involved. So this is a big project in Albania mm -hmm. and everything here is according to standard uh, ISO uh, 2009. It's a very strict procedure uh, about uh, measurement, about uh, calibration certificate for all tools and equipment that we need mm -hmm. to perform the work. For example, uh, for every tool that we use in here, uh, without calibration certificate we cannot use it. On paper, all the equipment seems so small. For example, this is uh, the uh, generator. But the scale of the project is literally enormous and it demands the utmost precision. Therefore, investments were made in the tools and machineries to provide for such qualified work. Another focus was the extra care for health and safety. Uh, when we look at the safety, our approach is, uh, is very clear, zero tolerance and zero deviation. It means that uh, we follow completely the rules here by Alstom uh, company standard of EHS with the tolerance zero for any risk here. We work in confined spaces, uh, we work at height, uh, we do a lot of lifting operations and these are the high risk uh, activities that people can get uh, seriously injured or even killed. And therefore everything is regulated. The employees need certified equipment and the right protection outfits. From helmets and gloves to the reflecting jackets and protected shoes. And they need to know when and how to wear it, so they can work according to protocol. Uh, my view on this is that MB are working very well. The hydro power plant is a challenging project, but MB Power has proven itself as a trustful partner. Uh, MB Power is a key partner in this project and uh, uh, there are not uh, many companies able to perform this job, uh, but they have uh, made a really good effort. Building a generator, building a machine, it is a specified job. And uh, I can say that only one team as MB Power have the powerful to make happen this, uh, this manufacturing of this machine. 
Without them, we will not uh, take this project to a good end. Until today, we see that uh, NB Power is really sensitive on these deadlines, it's trying to catch up to time. Uh, so they are just trying to monitor, anticipate uh, what can just come. And as long as you are just a team and just able to communicate in an anticipated way, uh, things are just getting resolved with such a good cooperation ground. And the CEO of MB Power is glad that he can contribute something to the supply of energy to Albania. Because we have had a very old power transmission network and the Albanian consumers have been in front of so many problems, missing the electricity, all of defects. Now we are in really good way because we are covering our all demand. Our power transmission network are now in security. MB Power has been one of the big partners to make such kind of intervention. And for that reason now Albania have 24 hours electricity without any interruption.